there's been some really disturbing comments. Even a racist comment like that nigger, like that. Yeah, that's was, a very racist. That was. This is why I love you. Ooh, this is why I love you. Because you love me. You love me. Hey guys. What's up, guys? It's Shane and Leanna. I just came out of work. I look so busted. It's the right now. So today we're doing what? So today we'll be reacting to a mean comment. Mm -hmm. So we just gonna read. We gonna react to it or we just gonna read it? We're just gonna read it and give a thought about it. Right. So it's more like a small reaction. We don't, we don't have to speak on it if you don't want to. Okay. So um, we're just gonna um, read all the eight comments that we got. We, we can't read all of them. I was gonna read most of them or some of them. Yeah. You know, it's like that. People gonna always ask someone to say negative, and it got majority of people saying positive stuff. But they're always gonna have that few people. One or two percent. Wanna say percent. something negative, you know? Like, like most popular video. You ever see a beautiful music video where the song is just perfect, and you always see a dislike? Like somebody don't like it. Everybody got preference, so it's okay. But some people feel like they need to give, they let their opinion out. And sometimes it's not good because it's called bullying. It's you bullying, but it's okay, we open to it and we, we accept it. Don't affect us at all. All right, so let's go through the comments right now. Yeah. But wait, wait. Before we go, we have to shout at the person who coming first yesterday. Okay. Let's and guess who was that? I am. No, that was um, Sholbach. Oh. So <laughs> what, bro? Thank you, bro. You be <laughs> you be commenting first. Hmm? Oh. Troll bot. Oh. Big up yourself, brother. You be commenting first a lot. You be doing good. But remember what I told you. You have to come in five times in a row to get a special surprise. If you come in three times and somebody come in first before you the fourth the fourth time, you start over. You gotta come in five times in a row back to back. So keep doing it, keep going. So let's see. So baby, we got a big surprise for them for whoever should come in first. We're gonna surprise them. We gotta come with something big. I think I got an idea. Uh huh. So whoever come in first, five times in a row. Damn, you, your nails is so long. You gonna cut it for me? Yeah, where's the nail clipper? I'm so scared in my bag. Get it for me. No, guys, seriously, I work really hard and I be really tired. Like, I be so tired. I literally do videos sometimes and be falling asleep. Like, and my husband be like, wake up. I'm like, I'm sorry. I be so tired. I just work really hard for my family. I'm almost about to be 30, so by 30 years old, I have some goals that I need to accomplish, right? And um, I'm going to accomplish them by working hard, like really hard. So, you know, it's never easy. I'm a mom. I have two babies. And I have all these things that I have to get done. Pro Gamer 119, come in. This channel needs to be deleted, and both of you should see a counselor, especially your wife. Come on, do you guys really think I need to see a counselor? They want our channel to be deleted. They said this channel should be deleted. Wow. So I, I feel like that's my signature. I'm known for being a big reactor. That's just who I am, who I really am. Like, you know what I mean? I'm just a screamer and... Yeah, she really reacts off camera, on camera. <laughs> That's who she is. So... It's, but... When it's a prank, it's like, it's naturally happening. That's how I act, but this is the thing, right? I don't... I don't... I'm not gonna... Don't think I fight with Shane every day. I'm gonna be in his face like ah, punching him. No. She have a mood. But if he's cheating on me or something that hurt me, I would. Yeah, fight she take that serious. You know what I mean? Serious. But I mean, like, 
I'm not gonna just be doing that for no reason. It has to be like a really good problem. So you see, if I cheat, she's gonna find me. If she's not, if she rather find me than leave. So you're gonna find me or you're gonna leave? Which one? Are you gonna do both? I'm gonna do both. Fuck so you, you Why well, you need to find me then? Let's leave then. No. You didn't need to find me. What's the purpose of you finding me? Because I feel like you need to know. <laughs> you need to know how hurt I am. You need to see that. So you feel the need for you to fight me. You need to put your hand on me. Yeah, I need to fuck you up. Wow. And why when you get fucked up? Back. Well, I should never put my hands on you, so I'm willing to take the lows. I like that, I like that. Alright. Next comment, I never cheat on you, baby, so. So good job. That's for the next one. So damn, the nigga said our channel needs to get deleted? Yeah. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. Damn. Simon the Bale Bond Bondsman. Mm -hmm. She's clearly insecure, bro. She must have low self esteem. She's right. lucky I'm not her man because she wouldn't be treating me like that. Who the fuck she thinks she is? Bro, she don't even trust you. I would have left her anyways by her not even trusting me. She's dumb. Good prank, but I always remember it wasn't. It was a print screenshot, so it, it got more. Wait. So why am I dumb? What prank was it for? Um, the chain, my chain, my passcode. I'm insecure because of that. Chain Clearly, my. if you're married and you guys been married for a long time, and you guys are always on each other's phone because this is what we do. YouTube, we laugh, we look at our videos together. And I feel that, period, if I feel the need I want to go on your phone, I should be able to. That's it. We're married. That just because I go on his phone doesn't mean I'm searching for any girls. I could go on his phone for a hundred things to pay my fucking credit card bill. Jesus Christ. I don't think that's insecurity. To be mad, if, if your partner is mad because their passcode phone has changed. What do you think about a changed passcode anyway? So you go on my phone, it's changed. You don't know nothing about it. I'll be upset. I question, I question you about it. Anybody would. I question you about it. I'm like, babe, why are you changing your password? Like, if it was open, I used to be access to it, and then you change it. Change it, it right. I'm going to be questioning about it. Like, because that never was yeah. you. I'm going to question us. about it. I'm just going to question it. Like, you know, not to be. Exactly. So that don't make any sense. But we have more good than negative, to be honest. There's a lot of comments because I have to go through all of them to find. The one that stand up. Clearly, I think a lot of people who comment never been in a relationship because they be saying the dumbest shit. People even had an issue with me saying nigga because I'm nice skin. You think that's you think that's cool? Yeah, someone's someone's like can't believe she was the N word. So um. What the fuck are you talking about, bro? The N word, like. That shit is so 1800s. Like, who even thinks about that? And I'm not saying nigger. I'm just saying nigger. Like, listen. To any people who are, like, really offended by the word, I mean, no harm by it. I mean, that's just the Bronx slang. And a lot of people stop actually using the word nigger so much. Everybody uses bro and sis, which nobody's my bro or sis. And I don't know, like people have something to say about, say about everything. Paulie Garcia, mm -hmm. this channel is pretty disturbing. Mm -hmm. So our channel is pretty disturbing to Paulie Garcia. Why? I don't know why, but our channel is very, very disturbing to Paulie Garcia. I don't know what to say about that. But um, you ever, thank you, thank you. You ever told them about the racist family? I'm trying about? to find a comment too. No, I got deleted. YouTube deleted it. Yeah, I think I, I did get a comment. I did get a racist comment too. Um, and one of her videos like a couple months ago, and it said that um, why is she with a black nigger? A black nigger. Yeah, we got racist coming too. So they were saying why is she? Oh, I pranked her and they said that's what you get when you, when you get with a nigger. First of all, this is what I have to say, right? 
So we're getting racial comments because it's a black and it's a it's a black and a white skin person together. So that's what you guys look at. That's that's what they look at. They don't care about nothing else. They just care that it's a white skin and black. Black. And like they don't black. even know if he's Dominican. They don't fucking know if I'm Jamaican. Like people don't even know. Like you could be black and white and have the same culture. Like this is why I find comments so stupid and pointless. Like No, I love the comments. I love them. Let all them come in. Bad comment, good comment. Bring it on. We open for it. Like you don't know, affect me that you know. No, it me. doesn't affect me, but this is why I would not read it, because to me it just makes no sense. It's just people giving an opinion. Everybody's obligated to their opinion. Same way I could say you you yes, that person listen, you're stupid but or whatever. This is what I'm saying. We're opinion. doing a video. You're obligated to your so opinion. So you can have an opinion about the video. We're doing a video. Why do a person feel they need to talk about our skin color or say I'm racist because I said a word or say he's a nigger? Bro, that shit is like the dumbest shit I ever heard. Yeah. I don't like like do you guys want to live in the past? That that's, was a serious racist comment though. They say, um, yeah, that that's shit what you scared get. Me. That's what you get when you get with um, a, nigger. a nigger. And I was like, wow. We still doing that? I mean, yeah, look at the president. Doing that? We can't, we can't request it. Look at the president we got in 2019 right now. Donald Trump. So you can't request it. Now. We oh, still, yes. Yeah, we're still doing that. Donald Trump emphasized on it too. There you go. I don't give a fuck about none of that. Oh, do people really still live in the past? Like, I completely try to... I completely try to, like... I really try not to think about any type of history or horror that went on. Because I feel like every all of that happened so we could be here today. So, you know what I mean? Why still drag on it? I don't know. K.I. underscore money. She ain't wife material, bro. Leave her ass. When how they, how the hell does he know that? So you, I, I'm not. You can't judge my wife based on a video. Yeah. You know. <laughs> I'm not putting. You see, she react in a in a prank. I'm not putting her in that predicament for her to react the way she react in a prank on a daily basis. You know. So I would I wouldn't. I wouldn't do a prank and because she react that way because I do a prank. I'ma end up leaving my wife, break up my own family. I have a family, it's my own family, you know? So, um... <laughs> so what happens if your mom reacted that way? Cause we got screaming mothers, nagging mothers. We got mothers that don't bother you. Mothers that don't push you to be better. Right, right, mothers right. who let you be. Every Everybody time. is different, you know? Right. Everybody is different and um... So if you had a mother like that, what would they say? Oh. Leave, um, fuck your mom, just, I hope No, you don't dies. leave, you don't, you, you try to help people. You know, if there's a problem, if you wouldn't like something, you help, you fix it. You work on it, you fix it with a person. Or, you know, accept people who they are, you know. So, um, you don't know, it's up and leave. And that's why the world is like this. Because as soon as a person gets get in a relationship, oh, this person does not fit my expectations, so I want to leave. And that's why a lot of people can't find a serious relationship. Instead of leaving, try to see if you can fix this person, build this person up. Let me try to help you, you know? Let me tell y'all, I built Shane, guys. Yeah, when I came to America, I didn't know America. She showed me a lot. I showed She showed me a lot about the culture and, and I learned to get along with a lot of people and do all this other stuff because when I came to the country, it was different. You know? He was even shocked to like see gay people. Now it's just the norm. I'm not saying we yeah, go parties with them, but he was shocked. Like me growing up as Jamaican, my culture is like anti-gay, but um, I'm, we're in America right now. It's open. People gay. It's okay. Let them be gay. But it's all love and peace. Mhm. Mm That's all I care about right there. It's all Why? love and peace. Because I know I'm not gay. Yeah. And nobody's bringing a gay conversation to me. So, right. You know? So what the fuck you mad about? Why, right? why would I go and kill a person or I want to fight a person because they're gay or I hate a person because they're gay? Like if that's your butthole gang. You know? So I wouldn't... That's not my business. Arash Manuel Cherry. I don't know how to pronounce that, that name. Mm -hmm. 
she come in, she's crazy, I hate her. <laughs> so one of our fans, Cholbat, Cholbat come in and reply, you are a bitter bitch, fuck off, pussy wall. <laughs> <laughs> Big up, brother. Big up myself, Cholbat. Number one fan. Big up myself, brother. Yeah, so. She hates me? She hate her based off a video. So she hate Lena based off a video. Hate, hate is a very strong yeah. word. Though. It's a very strong word. You know, I understand you dislike a video or you dislike the, or the behavior, but hate is a very strong word. So, yeah, guys, like, I, the comments make me realize how much, um, ignorance, you know, the world has. Social media geek, you come in and said, this guy is clearly abusive. Wow. So, it was a cheating prank that Lena did on me, and, um, I guess to some people it might be abusive. But I don't know, how do you want to, how should you react? I wasn't, I wasn't put a man on Lena. I grab her. You can watch a video. I grab her. But how do you? How do you want a person react? So when you love. When, when you love happen. somebody and you caught him in the act of cheating, you want to come and say, "Oh, baby, you cheated on me." Oh my God, let me go cry. No, <laughs> it's it's a it's it's a time of you. It's a time of angry reality. now. You're showing emotion, right. and some people really can't hold the emotion, and they end up doing crazy stuff. And I wasn't hitting, punching, and nothing like that. I grab her, like you know. I want to know what's going on like, on a serious level. So he started, oh, this guy's straight up. So, you know, one, one person comment and they read that comment, people start to believe it and, oh, you know, feed into it. So that guy, social media geek, saying I'm abusive, guys. Come in and tell me if you think I'm abusive. This person, too, Sarah Goodwin. Sorry, guys. This is so abusive. Where's that abusive in the video? Where? Maybe you should have punched me. And, that would be, and then, then, then you abusive. No, the woman walking and say, "Oh my God, baby, you cheated on me. Keep doing your thing, baby. I like it." Wow. No, you don't react like that when person cheated on you. You get caught in act, and I was scared. Like I'm, happy, I'm happy it was a prank, cause I was nervous. Seeing that you call my wife like in the act of cheating or whatever, even if it's not, not the girl, it's still, you know. So this person come in saying she's an abuser. Same like the guy saying I'm an abuser. So it's mostly coming that thing she's a, she's an abuser or she's Can insecure. I whip Shane's ass guys in no, reality? You can't. No, how can I abuse Shane? <laughs> if he slapped me one time I probably passed out. How could I be abusing him? Wait, can I angry. whip his ass? No, I just scream and get mad. And start swinging like a girl. Do I do that every time? No, I know better than to do that. I be acting like a crazy woman. That's just if a, if it's like something that will really hurt me, like cheating or you know when he gets me really good with those pranks. So now we back in the room because her hey, mom gotta use the kitchen. She's fugly with the and capital F. Dump her ass, man. Fugly. She's fugly with the capital. That doesn't bother me because I feel like. A, a female could be, um, every guy has their type, but I mean, is it, is it necessary to say something like that? I mean, I don't know, that wouldn't make sense, but you never fuck what people have to say. Exactly. <laughs> this person coming on the, um, the cheating prank I did earlier with the model, the twins, saying that I should, um, upgrade. So I, he should leave his baby mom to be with a naked ass girl. Nelson Sanchez, Lena is so abusive. So I just said the same shit. MR Beefy, I can't really enjoy these prank because I found her to be very disrespectful and abusive. So you can't enjoy her video because you find her reaction, her natural reaction to be very, very disrespectful. So you, you, you choose not to watch her video or you just find that video specifically disrespectful or what? I don't know. What do you think? I think that all these com I think that negative comments are so like it, it gives me an opportunity to understand how people really think in this world and it's really a sad thing. Because personally I will never comment on somebody's on the somebody's video and write some crazy, hateful, stupid shit. Like there's been some really disturbing comments, even a racist comment like that nigger, like that. Yeah, that's a very racist comment. That was one comment. of the worst comments to me that I ever witnessed. This person, um, 
Emmer Simanovic. This channel is so cringe and disturbing. Man, you need to leave that woman because she's not good in the head. It's all time kind of disturbing. Why? Now, if my reaction is bad because I love someone and that's how I react and they disturbed by it, then I don't give a fuck. You understand what I'm saying? Because that's something I feel that needs to be done at the moment. That's just the way I feel about it. So, and the way Shane reacts towards me, what you want me to say? You want me to see a person's true colors and not be with them? Then you're never gonna be happy because some people react way different. Some people fucking kill you right on the spot. Like, I don't, I don't know, I think it's ridiculous. This woman is abusive and you allow her to use the n-word highly disrespectful and inappropriate this account should be removed and you two need to see couple counselor prank or not prank or not so we, sh we our channel need to be deleted because of a natural reaction and we should go see counselor wow really do you, do you even know a relationship do you know a relationship personally like we show you guys our pranks on YouTube, but do you know our day-to-day -day relationship? Not even that. Do you know what a relationship consists of? Like, you ever been in a relationship? And I'm not saying, I'm not saying that in a relationship, your woman's going to be going crazy. Your man is going to be going crazy. Y'all should be beating each other up. No, I'm not saying that. But in a relationship, when you love someone, you're going to fight for it. And however you react towards that, that's just the way you are. You understand? Now, if you're the type of woman that your man is cheating on you and you like, you know what, I'm so disappointed that you cheated on me, I guarantee you that that's not a reaction a man will want regardless. Like, he will want to feel a lot more love. Like, yo, every time I do something to this girl, she's just so okay with it. No, that's not good either. And to overreact is not good either. But, I mean, just reacting generally, I think that's natural. You're going to react. Period. Yolanda is out of control. She got issues, emotional issues. She's super abusive and unstable. She's too insecure and ignorant. Wow. So if you're in a relationship. So insecure. And someone changes their password, just be like, okay. If you're in a relationship, someone's hiding something from you, be like, okay. If you get cheated on, be like, okay, I'm leaving you, never looking at you again. That's not reality. Not when you love someone. I'm sorry, that's not real. That's people who never been in a relationship and think that's how things should go, but it's not. She was crazy and definitely have trust issues. Leave that cycle before it's too late. People just feel okay to give a comment. They don't care, like, you know. Definitely something wrong with this girl, Polly Garcia. She come in already and that negative comment, that's her second negative comment. This is disgusting, man, it's disgusting. Comment on the kissing channel that we was doing. Kissing channel? Yeah. So I guess her kissing is disgusting. A lot of people don't like kissing. Like I, like I told you in front of the video, if you can't see a person kiss, don't watch it. We even said that in the beginning of the video. People, this is what I'm saying. What's the point of their comments? Like, oh, we told you guys. Yeah. You, you know that our channel is based off pranks, right? And you know what a prank is, right? So what's the point of your comments? Like, I don't understand what's the point of your negative comment. Like, I don't, I don't get it. I don't get, even kissing, I don't even understand how that, like, there's been some really disturbing comments, even a racist comment, like, that nigger, like, that. Yeah, that's a very racist. That was to be a negative comment, like, mind your business. As you guys read all the comments, they basically saying that she's insecure, she's, um, abusive, but that's a natural reaction when a girl caught the men in the act of cheating or in the act of being disrespected. You know, and um, I feel like that's that's our reaction. You know, and I love my wife. She, I, I'm not like I told you. I'm not putting her in a predicament where I take her a character like that. So why 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 the fuck would I leave her? Why? That makes no sense. I'm not gonna leave my wife based off a, a prank and the way she be even a prank. I'm pranking her. I know I know I'm not really doing this. You know, so I, I do it intentionally to get a reaction. And you guys really watch because of her reaction. I guarantee if she did if she didn't react like a certain way, you guys wouldn't be interested to watch, to be honest. If I say, oh my god, why you did that to me? Then you guys would be like, what fucking channel is this? You know, I mean, who would have that much subscribers if 
if we didn't react, we would react. And that's just who we are naturally. You understand? There's no so way I'm person. So that's why you guys like us, because of our signature, like who we are. You understand? Because if a person is, um, like for example, they're saying I'm, I'm abusive. Like I told you guys, if I, if I walk in and call my wife cheating, whatever, I'm not gonna come in and say, oh my God, baby, you cheated on me. I'm gonna come cry about it. Then like, what kind of man is this? You know what I'm saying? And then you guys can come and yo, that yo, I would have beat her, got out of, you know? People will come in that say no to do certain stuff. Everybody was different, but that's just who I am. So thank for all the mean comments. That's, I don't read comments. Yeah, you know? I don't read I like all comments. Negative, good, cause we're open. That, that only make us stronger and be prepared for more. Like for the worst, you understand? So if I can't handle a comment that's coming through um my YouTube, how the fuck am I handle comment if people want to say it to me in my face? You understand? So I gotta learn to deal with these comments on our channel. So just in case people want to give a public comment when they see us face to face, we know how to deal with it. I don't care about none of that. Like, ain't nobody gonna see me face to face and tell me anything because then my attitude's gonna really come out. You understand what I'm saying? And that's just how I grew up. It's nothing I could do. I'm a Bronx girl. Like, any girl you really see from the Bronx, that's their attitude. You could go down to J-Lo, one of the richest women that you know. Like, not one of the richest, but she's a very successful woman in her career. So, it, that's our attitude. That's just who we are. Nobody's gonna punk me. Nobody's gonna play me. And I'm just <laughs> gonna be there like, okay. Like, I will fight you and then we can break up after I fight you. But first, I have to fight you. Like, that's it. That's who I am. If people don't like it, then do not watch me. I only respect the people who respect me. So simple as that. I love the people who support me and respect me and give nothing but positivity. Other than that, everybody else could kick rocks. I don't care about them. We love our fans, guys. Exactly. And our fans be defending us. Yes. So, everybody will be replying to those negative comments. We thank you guys so much. Keep supporting us. Keep being loyal to Shane and Leanna. That's in our family. And we love you guys. Continue supporting our channel. We got more videos and more awesome videos. Like not not only pranks, but awesome videos just beside from pranks gonna come. Guys, I I like to prank Shane. Like that's what it is. So whoever be like, oh, I'm tired of watching pranks. I don't know what to tell you. I like to prank him. I'm not gonna sit down and talk in the camera all day. I like to prank it's not him like in we, action. I it, like to see. Yeah, it's not like we're doing um the same prank every day. So it's like, it's hard, sometimes hard to call up on a certain prank. The way the prank is happening so sudden, it's hard, you know? And we, I know what I'm doing, I'm pranking them. So I know you guys probably saying, oh, they're pranking each other every day, but. He knows when to do it. It's a time frame for everything. You know when it's the best move, cause sometimes even outside from prank, maybe we have an argument and I say, oh, you know what, since she mad, today's the best day I'm a pranker. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So, so, so because she already mad already, it just, the prank just come up perfect. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying guys. Alright guys, so I want you guys to keep supporting our channel. Thank you guys for watching. We love you guys. Team Shane and Team Leanna. All day, every day. Love you guys.